<laughs> What's happening, YouTube, man? 93 Sports Dude, back at y'all with another video. All right, this is a response video to Jeff from Dream Chaser Boxing, man. Excellent video. Um, I heard it, and it was kind of funny because um, you're kind of going all over the place and not trying to stick to what I'm talking about. I'm talking about the outrageous. He went to a team that beat him, and this wasn't something that happened 10 years ago. This happened recently. This was 2015 Western Conference semifinals when the Clippers was up three games to one on the Houston Rockets. And they had an epic collapse and lost three in a row. Okay. Now, I get what you're saying by you're saying that there's a lot of differences. Because you're saying that to try to suit your argument. I can go back and say the same thing about the LeBron James and, and the Kevin Durant situation. There's a lot of differences there. And you said in your video that what Kevin Durant did was worse than what LeBron James did. But they have a lot of differences. So you're kind of not making any sense when you're trying to compare those situations. I'm talking about you. A lot of people are saying you know you're not supposed to go to a team that beat you. And what Kevin Durant did was a weak move. The Clippers was up three games to one on the Houston Rockets, just like OK, just like OKC was against the Warriors. In that year. The Clippers was a serious threat. A lot of some people actually picked the Clippers to come out the West that year. All right, and actually, the Houston Rockets now have three All Stars because Nene is a former All Star, along with Chris Paul and uh, James Harden, obviously. So when you're sitting there saying, "Oh," the, I'm missing differences. I know there's, I know there's differences. There's obviously a lot of differences. There's differences with a lot of situations, but at the same time, I'm talking about the similarity that Kevin Durant went to a team that beat him in the playoffs, just like Chris Paul did. Is, is that not similar? Now, sure, he didn't go there the year prior, but he still went there. And I seen people in your comment section saying, oh, he got traded. No, he opted out of his contract and became a free agent and was interested in playing with the Rockets. Like I said in my previous video. Then they did a sign and trade. But you act like like they're playing like he he's just playing with James Harden. He has I don't know if you watch the Houston Rockets basketball, but they 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 have snipers. They have shooters like Ryan Anderson. Ryan Anderson can ball. Trevor Reza can ball. Eric Gordon can ball. We already know what James Harden can do. You know what I'm saying? It's not it's not like he's playing with scrubs. He's playing with bums. He went on a team that won 55 games last year. And was third in the West. And you're sitting there saying that Kevin Durant went to this super team, this and that. A lot of their core players that the Golden State Warriors have, they drafted. When LeBron James went to South Beach... And wanted to take his talents to Miami Heat. So you like that because you know you you from you from the Sunshine State. You from Miami. Did did they draft Chris Bosch? Mm -mm, he he signed there as a free agent. Did did he uh did, did Ray Allen uh get drafted by the Miami Heat? Nah. Mm -mm. Did LeBron get drafted by the Miami Heat? Nah. He went there as a free agent. A lot of their core players that the Miami Heat have was from other teams. What other all-stars 
that that the Golden State Warriors picked up other than Kevin Durant. See what I'm saying? Like I, we can play this game all day about there's differences. There's differences in every situation. But the facts remain is that Chris Paul did go to a team that beat him in the playoffs, just like Kevin Durant did. Simple as that. 93 Sports News. I'm gone. Peace.